Prince Harry and Meghan Markle reportedly desire peace talks with the royal family to bring an end to their ongoing and highly publicized feud. The couple, who stepped down as senior royals in 2020 and relocated to California, have remained at odds with the royal family ever since, with tensions only escalating over time. While Harry and Meghan appear eager for reconciliation, their attempts to mend relationships are met with significant hesitation, particularly due to concerns about trust and privacy. The royal family, especially certain members, remain wary of Harry's intentions. Their apprehension stems from the fear that any private discussions might later be revealed in a sequel to Harry's memoir, Spare, which has already caused considerable damage to the family's public image. This distrust is a significant barrier to any potential peace talks, as the royals are cautious about opening up, only to have their words potentially used against them in future tell-all narratives. King Charles, however, seems more inclined towards reconciliation than some of his relatives. Despite the deep wounds caused by past events, he reportedly holds out hope for rebuilding his relationship with his son. Since ascending to the throne, King Charles has increasingly sought solace in spiritual guidance, a factor that might influence his more open stance toward a possible resolution with Harry. His newfound focus on spiritual matters has provided him with a sense of calm and clarity, possibly making him more receptive to the idea of peace talks, despite the risk involved. However, this openness is not universally shared within the royal family. Other members, still stung by the couple's actions and the fallout from their various public statements, remain less forgiving. The fear that Harry and Meghan might exploit any attempts at reconciliation for their own benefit continues to loom large. These royals believe that the couple's previous behavior has not demonstrated a genuine desire for resolution, but rather a strategic move to maintain their public relevance and financial gains through controversial disclosures. The situation is further complicated by the ongoing speculation that the couple may seek to publish more content about their royal experiences, which keeps the atmosphere of suspicion and mistrust alive. This possibility makes it difficult for the royal family to consider any overtures from Harry and Meghan without worrying about future betrayals. The lingering sense of betrayal is a heavy burden, and it casts a long shadow over any potential peace talks. For now, it seems that the path to reconciliation is fraught with obstacles. King Charles might be willing to forgive and forget, drawing strength from his spiritual practices, but without the full support of the rest of the family, any attempt at peace might be short-lived. The hesitance of other family members coupled with their mistrust could very well undermine any progress that might be made in these potential peace talks. The question remains whether the deep divisions within the family can be healed or if the chasm between them will only widen further, driven by the fear of more public revelations. The royal family's reluctance to engage with Harry and Meghan, particularly due to fears of further exposure, illustrates the complexity of their fractured relationships. As the world watches, hoping for a resolution, it remains to be seen whether these differences can ever be reconciled or if the once-closed bonds between Harry and his family are forever shattered.